Hey, okay, so this message, this video is going to be about how to enter a new customer into your My Customers app from your phone. And so the very first thing you want to do is you're going to enter, you're going to click that little plus in the lower right hand corner, and then you're going to hit the little person with a little plus. That's entering a new person. So you have a couple of options. If this was a friend of yours that you already have in your contacts, you can easily add them from your contacts. I'm actually going to enter myself just so I don't have anybody's private information on this video that who knows who will be watching it. Um, so I'll just put this here. Now, I do recommend that if you have a picture of that person, maybe you did a makeover with them and you took an after picture, to go ahead and, and put their picture in here. I'm going to just go ahead and take one from my of myself right, right now. Um, <laughs> so we can use that. So you can use that. Okay, so I've got my little face in there now. That is really helpful, especially when you, if you're new and you don't already have a lot of people, trust me, as you go on with this business, you're going to meet a lot of people you don't know. And then after a while... It gets really um, hard to remember who they were if you know if you've only met them once and then they continue to reorder. Okay, so I'm just going to enter phone number. Um, and then email. Okay. And so when you hit the, um, the email, you'll notice here it says email subscriptions. And I could unclick these if I didn't want them to receive any, but I never do, I always keep them clicked. They are always able to opt out if they don't wanna receive those things. But the one, um, two things, the e-cards and personal communication, that's where you can send birthday e-cards from, from InTouch, it's really great. And then the product reorder reminders is an awesome system that runs behind the scenes. So when you put their order in here, say they bought a cleanser, then the company knows after so many months that cleanser should be running out and they will send them an email um, from you just saying, hey, you might be getting low on your cleanser. If you need to order more, you can click here and it takes them right to your website. So it's a super great system that runs behind the scenes. And that's why it's another reason why it's so good to put your orders in um, on your app or on in touch uh, so that the company knows that they can send those out for you. All right, coming down to the address. So, you know, um, I would put my address in here, you know, any important dates, my birthday, I could put my birthday in here. That's not my birthday, but we'll just pretend it is. My spouse, you know, I can put my spouse's name in here. Maybe I should make it capitalized like a real name. There you go. Um, maybe I want to tag me myself. So I am a great customer. So I would hit best customer or a customer if that's something you're using. I definitely am on the biocellulose. I love the charcoal mask. I really love everything. But I'm also specifically, I was I have in here repair, time-wise repair. So these are tags. These are like sub subcategories within your database of your customers. So you can tag with whatever you want to tag. And then um, you can add more tags and you can add a special note down here. So if there's something that you want to remember about that person or maybe your last form of contact or maybe their foundation shade because there really is no place to put their actual foundation shade so that's a really great place to put it right there and uh in the type of um you know foundation that they like okay anyway and so then i'm gonna hit all right and now it's in there so if i ever want to find that person i can go through the alphabet i can come on down here to p's you know i can come back i can do a search right there all different ways to find that person to to get what they need now